What's going on guys? Spencer here with HM Massage. Today is going to be a quick video talking about tipping. You want to tip? Don't ever play leapfrog with a unicorn. No, the real question is how much should you tip your massage therapist after a massage? I wanted to start this off by telling people that I, as a therapist, do not expect tips. And this is both at my own practice and back when I was working at a spa. I never went in expecting money afterwards. And then I was never disappointed. I've seen therapists in the back break rooms literally getting super mad and upset because a client didn't tip them. And I feel like that's not the right mindset to go into it. I find it's better if you don't expect anything, then you're never disappointed and you're more commonly surprised. But tipping for a lot of people is really important and especially in the Western culture has become kind of expected. So how much should you tip during a session? This will obviously depend on whether you're going to a private practice or a big chain or spa. Now when it comes to a private practice, I generally, as I said, don't expect tips and I'm perfectly okay with only receiving the amount we agreed on. There's a reason that I as a private practice and most people in their practice have set that price and that is the price that they feel they are worth. And so I believe that if you pay them that amount, I think it's good. I would much rather have you rebook at a later session than spend that money tipping me extra, if that makes sense. Now at a spa or clinic, this is different. And it's obviously going to depend upon the price range of the spa, but go in knowing that therapists at a spa are usually making about 15 to 20 percent of what the massage costs. So let's say you go into a spa and it costs $100 for an hour session. A therapist is probably making in the realm of $16 to $20 for that session. I think you can never go wrong with about 15% as an average, meaning you can do a little less, you can do a little more, but around that price range is a really good tipping amount that no therapist is going to be upset about. So if you have that same $100 session for the hour and you tip the massage therapist a $15 tip for that one hour session, I think they'll be pleasantly surprised. The spas I worked at were a little less than that. The average hour session was about $70. And so the average tip I got was about $12. And once again, I was super happy with even $5, but $10, $12. And then if you give somebody $20 on the hour, that's incredible. They're going to seriously love you forever. You're going down as an awesome person in their books. Anything higher than that, the therapist is going to greatly appreciate. And especially at spa and clinics where the therapist isn't quite getting all the money they deserve, they are still putting in a lot of extra work. And so that tipping can really go the extra mile to show them that you really appreciate their massage and it will go a long way in helping them. But remember, if you can't tip during a session, don't feel too bad about it. A therapist should never change their session and their intent based upon how much money they think they're gonna get. They should go in, like I said, knowing you're gonna get the amount that you've already agreed on whether that's a private contractor or a spa or establishment, and then anything else should be a bonus. But on the flip side, don't come in, be a high demanding client, and then don't leave a tip and see them every single week, because then they're just gonna come to resent you. So of course there's a balance. And story time, what's the highest tip I've ever gotten in a massage? Well, for a couple of 90 minute sessions, I got $100. That was the best tip I've ever gotten. It was pretty awesome to receive that. And it's always a good reminder that you're doing something right in the world of massage. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this quick little video. Go ahead and like it if you did and subscribe to the channel for new content every single week. I will see you guys on the next video. I hope you have a great rest of your day.